hey everyone welcome to java express academy so today we are going to discuss another coding challenge commonly in interview room you uh, you may hear this type of question find duplicate elements in a list you have an array you have some elements you want to find out the duplicate elements we using java 8 okay so we have lot of approaches we have to do this activity i am going to demonstrate you one of the best okay uh, for this use case here guys hope you will enjoy why we need a duplicates basically for a data cleaning purpose or filtering the data okay where you can able to see a list of elements or list of customer names okay where you want to filter the data so if you want to find out the duplicate elements in a list we have mainly three approaches we have number one using has it okay basically it it required for small task guys using this approach okay we can go ahead for has set it is a simple and straightforward here then using okay java 8 streams java 8 streams this is basically a modern approach where you can able to do this activity and we have a another approach same pattern using okay basically a frequency map using basically it is a frequency map basically this is a best for large data with counts as well how many duplicates are available okay everything we can able to do in interview room which is the best okay uh, if you use a distinct uh, uh, like not a distinct thing mean to say lot of people are uh, in interview room the people are used to write about one or two approaches third one very rarely people used to write now i'm going to demonstrate you third approach it's very important have a look you guys can have a try first and second approaches and drop a message in the comment box as well i will have a look as well guys okay now let me start with our coding session so that it will be easy for you okay now couple of people uh, in the chart window also i mean to say uh, in the comment box some people are saying using distinct also we can achieve the solution people are normally used to um, uh, say that using distinct also but distinct yeah it's a straightforward and answer will be very shorthand right in interview room you need to write a lot of lines of code as well then they will know java 8 you know very well okay uh, now have a look here now what i'm doing i'm creating a package just i'm making as a duplicates just i'm writing one of my own uh, package name here uh, how you can achieve this activity here okay now first you need a numbers now let me create as a uh, duplicates remove okay java 8 just i'm writing one line now just have a look here now let me go to a main method now you need a uh, array of elements now let me take some integer of elements let me take some numbers arrays dot as list and you can write one comma two comma three comma four comma five and then five comma three comma two okay now from here i want to uh, find out the duplicates here now you have a array here right uh, now what is the next step now you know very well grouping by i'm trying to solve a lot of problems using grouping by try to learn as much as lot of problems is the best solution by using grouping by here okay now numbers dot stream first from the stream you need to collect the information again from the collectors okay if you are a completely new guys please go ahead and uh, watch all my java 8 coding challenges um inside the description you have a backup videos as well you can go ahead and do that activity okay now grouping by here in this grouping by there is a two um, uh, single argument double argument and one parameter two parameter and three parameters now in our use case this is the best option two parameters here this is means your input data this is for the counting what are the duplicates we have okay now here what i'm doing like i want to take a number n column n and from the collectors dot we have a method called counting method that's it's very simple and that easy guys from here you will get one map object here this is nothing but a frequency map object here integer 
which number long how many number of okay um, times it is repeated that information you can able to see here if you see system dot out dot print ln if you see frequency map now right click run as java application now if you see here in the logs one equals to one two equal to two times three equal to two times four equal to one five out of that i v2 verify greater than one those elements are duplicate elements that is the one i need to find out here greater than means means a two three and a five two three five are the duplicate elements now how i can do that i can do some filter how i can do see using frequency map now again i need to do a entry set from here i need to do the stream of information now here you can do the filter now you will get some entry in that entry it's a key comma value dot get value if get value is greater than one then what should i do i need to get a map object so just you can map it here um map dot entry okay where only key is required i don't want remaining all the things from the get again i can do the collectors collectors dot to list that's it now see if you write this piece of code he knows hey you know very well about java it as well guys okay in this pattern see even single line answers we can achieve guys but the main motive is in enter your room you should write okay these many methods you are writing miss he knows very well okay what are the things you know okay now duplicates now see here right click run as java application now see 235 is the duplicate elements so using group by function i can achieve this is the solution for this problem here even not only here here you can write alternatively function dot identity by default it will take as a same argument here same meaning here yes few places you may see here few places using lambda also you can write it here here filter is the main topic value is greater than one those i can find out the duplicates with the counts as well how many times it is uh, duplicated okay now same pattern i can achieve uh, another approach uh, using normal uh, filters how i can do using the set here how i can do that means another approach um, approach one okay uh, what i can do just remove everything here okay see here it's a simple and straightforward to do first i need to create a set object okay set object uh, so duplicates equals to new hash set okay new hash set here just i written this will. now i want to take a data type uh, i don't want here you can specify the set integer okay it's a integer now, now what i can do from the numbers what i will do using the stream i can filter the data here also this is also number one what i can do i am i want to add the numbers into this set object see add of a number what is the number you have a number then what i can do collect collectors dot to list that's it now you will get your output here see these are the duplicates you have guys now if you see here duplicates one right click run as java application see 532 here this is a, a what we are doing simply here you we are using simple stream api now this condition is doing keep only duplicate elements that's it only if not added means it is a duplicate if it is adding means it's not a duplicate that is the only the context here this is one of the approach the same condition we can write using traditional for loop as well guys okay that is not required i think this is, i recommend you to go for this approach here guys using java 8 here if they're asking don't use any java 8 that is again different pattern how you can achieve this kind of uh, uh, solutions as well guys okay so accordingly now basically you guys which one is the most recommended approach okay which method do you like out of these two just comment guys for tricks java tricks this type of questions join like and subscribe our channel so you guys can try with the strings 
or characters and uh, share your screenshots or code in the chat window so that we can discuss more on this topic as well as thank you we'll see you in the next lecture